Hi folks, Alex Klingelhafer here with Exential Wealth Advisors. It is 8.15 here in the middle part of the country on Wednesday. It is November 17th, 2021. Here's your morning jog around the economic headlines of the world. We're going to talk earnings this morning. And what better place to start off than my wife's favorite retailer, Target. Target with some actually really good earnings yesterday earning more than a billion more dollars than uh, consensus estimates on the revenue side income also up you know 20 or, or 25 cents a share above estimates stock down a little bit uh, here in the pre-market this morning really talking about supply chain pressures on a go forward basis right products being a little bit more expensive as we head into the holiday shopping season Overall, it looks like not a tremendous impact. They're still going to have plenty of shelves stocked for the holiday season. Earnings continue to be good. Stocks continue to do well as a whole. Echoing that sentiment, lows, big earnings beat, upward forecasts, consumers doing more projects around the house. Of course, lows, really always a secondary player. To Home Depot just doesn't have quite the same in-store experience. They are really catching up. I certainly go to both of them quite a bit. Uh, also saying uh, same store sales rose by 2.2%. Yeah, you know, Earnings really, really good. Again, if earnings continue to be good, if the S&P continues to grind higher into the end of the year, we would not be surprised because when we're looking at the fundamental difference between last year and this year in the economy we're seeing a lot less uncertainty we're seeing corporations continue to make money that makes stocks more attractive last but not least before we get you off to a nice wednesday crypto.com buying naming rights to the staples center looks like it's going to be a 700 million dollar year uh deal i believe it's for 20 years uh that's going to be 35 million dollars a year really an era coming to an end. The Staples Center has been uh, named that for years and years and years. Big box retailers are out. Crypto platforms are in. At least on a go forward basis, we'll see if 20 years from now, that looks like an anachronistic name. If you want some additional information throughout the week, feel free to follow me. As always, I'm on Twitter. It's OKC CFA. CFP. Until then, I do hope you have a very nice Wednesday. I'm out.